Ken Cohen. I, I've lived in Flushing since 19, May of 1952. The area of Flushing has always been somewhat unique, and the communities have been around for a long time, especially the African-American communities. Uh, trace uh, people in, in the community I live in Oh, back to the early 1900s. Wow. But I know in downtown Flushing, you, you go way back. Yeah. <laughs> you know, because of the Quaker influence here and the, 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 the fact that, that this was a port and, you know, they brought slaves in all along Long Island. Not that that Long Island was exempt from slavery because there were slaves in, in uh, Long Island, actually in Queens. Uh, there's a um, uh, in Fresh Meadows, for a fact, uh, it was called the Blackstone Plantation, and they had slaves. So, but you know, there was also a lot of free African Americans in in Flushing, and and they they actually lived right around here, <laughs> uh, specifically parking lot number one, but even more so off of Main Street, and actually up until. I would say 98, mm -hmm. uh, you saw them start to diminish. But if you go down Linden Place, there were a lot of s those small homes still remaining. And um, they, uh, they started to, and African Americans lived there. But somewhere closer to 2000, mm -hmm. there, that's when the, the change happened. And, and the, new, the new group of ethnic Groups started moving in the the Asian well the Asian community started in the mid eighties as a strong point, and um, they you know the Asian Southeast Asian this is a melting pot, so you, you can't actually pinpoint which group. Ha well, you can, some will say the Chinese, some will say the Koreans. Some now you have the, the you know the, the the Indians, the Pakistanians, the the Afghanis. They, they're they're all part of the mixture, and and then you have the the Russians, which are Asians as well. Some people forget that. So you know we we've, we've drastically changed from the the Italian Irish community, German community that existed in growing up here. And you know, it's it's a difference.